Okay, we have an X32 rack here with what I think is a power supply issue. So it essentially just have, oh bad, these lights, these LED lights were faded and blinking uh, and uh, it was stuck in that in the power on state and messing around with it a little bit, it would come on uh, for temporarily and then finally it just stopped turning on at all. So uh, what I've done is I've ordered a new uh, power supply here, the uh, power supply for the X32 rack, which is available through full compass and uh, I'm going to take this thing apart and replace the power supply and see if it works. Wish me luck. Okay, so I've taken the cover off. There was uh, six or eight screws, very small screws on the top and the cover lifts up and we can see that this is the power supply. So if we're around the back, you can see the power supply is here and from the front power supply is here and so I'm going to remove that there's some screws right down in there and I'm going to remove all the uh, wires here and just make sure that I mark where they go back in they most of the time they're gonna key only back in but we'll just be careful that they go exactly the way they were uh, so I'm gonna do that and wish me luck Okay, some things to note in here. So I marked these white cables front and back. They were plugged in here. Uh, the, they have these little clips on them here that you need to press with your thumb, and they're actually attached to the cable, not to the board. So you press them from the top, and they release. They are a little bit fragile. And then it appears that there are four clips here, which hold... Uh, something to the board. Hopefully those aren't thermally pasted in. We'll have to see whether or not those come out easily or not. Okay, so I've removed this board from the unit and I actually made a mistake here because the entire unit comes out as with the metal bit. So um, you know, it doesn't matter because I'm replacing it, but you can see that there's a metal sled on it, and we actually have to remove that with these four, one, two, three, four screws, uh, which this should lift out, and then the whole thing will replace, which will uh, be a lot cleaner. Uh, so that's a good thing. Also, uh, I didn't mention it, but you should definitely be careful. There's, uh, you know, there's a pretty high capacity capacitor here that can hold charge even when it's been unplugged and off for a while so uh, you should be really careful about what you touch on the power unit alright the new power supply board is in place I think I got all of the wires back in and we're gonna see whether this works we have lights Woohoo! we have screen and we have action all right, so uh, fixed up for about $60. Uh, our X32 rack, didn't have to send it in. Saved probably a few hundred dollars in shipping and repair costs. Just going to put the uh, top back on and remount it. Super happy.